Optus has revealed they learned of a major cybersecurity attack a day prior to notifying customers of the breach. On Thursday afternoon, Optus announced the personal information of up to 9 million customers had been compromised during a major cyber breach. Watch in the video above, details as Optus suffers major data breach. Watch the latest news on Channel 7 or stream for free on 7 Plus however, Optus CEO Kelly Bayer Rosemarin said the company learned of the breach a day earlier. In an update on Friday, Rosemarin described the attack as sophisticated. We are taking full accountability for what has happened, she said. No ransomware demands have been made. But it's too early to rule out any possibilities. Rosemarin said Optus will be contacting all customers in the next few days. All customers will be contacted, including those who have not been affected, and they will know what category they will fall into, she said. While it is estimated up to 9.8 million people may have been affected, Rosemarin described this number as a worst-case scenario. We have reason to believe that number is actually much lower, she said. Once we've worked through all the relevant information, we expect that number will be much lower. But again, our teams are looking into every possibility. Rosemarin said the message to Optus customers is to remain alert. What customers can do is be vigilant, if anything unusual occurs report it, be alert to any activity that seems suspicious or odd. Human error Meanwhile, preliminary investigations by Optus suggest an error by an IT programmer may have inadvertently allowed cybercriminals to access the database. It's still under investigation, however, this breach, like most, appears to come down to human error, a senior figure for Optus told the ABC on the condition of anonymity. They wanted to make integrating systems easier, to satisfy two-factor authentication regulations from the industry watchdog, the Australian Communications and Media Authority ACMA. Eventually, one of the networks it was exposed to was a test network which happened to have internet access. This allowed access to the Optus network from outside the company. However, in Friday morning's press conference, Rosemarin said she could not go into specifics of how the attack occurred as the matter is the subject of criminal proceedings. Optus has very strong cyber defenses, cybersecurity has a lot of focus and investment here and so this should serve as a warning call to all organizations, there are sophisticated criminals out there, and we really need all organizations out there to be on alert, she said. Details of cyber attack released Optus Australia confirmed the attack on Thursday, stating it was investigating the possible unauthorized access of current and former customers' information. We are devastated to discover that we have been subject to a cyber attack that has resulted in the disclosure of our customers' personal information to someone who shouldn't see it, Rosemarin said. As soon as we knew, we took action to block the attack and began an immediate investigation. While not everyone may be affected and our investigation is not yet complete, we want all of our customers to be aware of what has happened as soon as possible so that they can increase their vigilance. Optus assured payment details and account passwords had not been compromised and Optus services, including mobile and home internet, are not affected. Optus has also notified key financial institutions about this matter, Rosemarin said. While we are not aware of customers having suffered any harm, we encourage customers to have heightened awareness across their accounts, including looking out for unusual or fraudulent activity and any notifications which seem odd or suspicious. We are very sorry and understand customers will be concerned. Please be assured that we are working hard to help safeguard our customers as much as possible. Cybersecurity Minister Claire O'Neill told 7news.com.au, the Australian Cybersecurity Centre is providing cybersecurity advice and technical assistance in relation to the cyber attack involving Optus. Australian Federal Police, the Office of the Australian Information Regulator and other key regulators have also been notified. And finally, thank you all for watching the video. Please like and comment your opinion so we can discuss together, don't forget to subscribe, press the bell to follow and update many other interesting news. See you in the next videos. Goodbye.